coming in. Looks like he's going to take this seriously. Here we go. I think we got the colors correctly because I think Rishi is patented green. And that was we got okay. tech. We got tech. Look, we're, we're talking about Rishi here, right? We we break full shields with tippers. Yeah. That's that's what I'm seeing right now. Yeah. Rishi is one of the best at this matchup in the world, honestly. This man this man's beaten Mewtwo King in the ditto. Yeah. He's one I of think the, that's as hard as it gets. I, I think he might be top two or top three at the matchup. Um, Z Zane. I is the only one I would put above him. Zane, you have to put Zane slightly above him. But, he, you know, everyone knows... He's from the same region. They trained together. They they came up essentially together. Yeah. Shared all their tips. Played each other endlessly. You know what I think made Zane crazy? Having him and Rishi both having to play against Lod. That'll make anyone tech heavy. What? You think so? <laughs> you just need pivots. Oh, that's true. Crazy. Yeah, that makes sense. I mean, MDVA has that region kind of locked down. Uh, Rishi now for the past couple years has been New York. Oh, that space right outside of Tipper. He knew it. Like, he, he didn't, like, just space outside of where Eddie Tipper, because, like, a normal Tipper could have hit him if he was a little closer, but he spaced just outside of where he was standing for the Tipper. Yeah. That, that's a malaise. One of the most important matchups to have your spacing down, obviously. The, most, uh, the recovery is the hardest thing in this matchup. Yeah. Love that. I love that recovery. Oh. Or the... Uh, Doesn't turn it around. The PC drop. Legitimately really good. I've seen him take a few stocks so far today doing that. Yeah, it's not just stylish, man. It's it's, just, it's optimal. It's, if it's the fastest way you can get there. Really good, yeah. Okay, I love the babysitting. This is a pretty string-heavy game so far. Um, both these guys' DIs is very knowledgeable and very good where they're not allowing themselves to be comboed endlessly. Um, what that means is like the the metagame is going to be so interesting. Okay. Uh, the, the tiny metagame that it develops is how good is your DI, when can you break out of these combos. I, I think Rishi has this lead solidly because he's getting every grab opening and he's taking... He's stacking on him so much percent in these little neutral exchanges. Yeah, I and think then just edge guarding him for another 20, 50 percent. I, de I definitely think he's winning neutral more often. Um, we'll see how this punish ends up for, for Zealous. Now, see, like, it, it, he got out of that, and Zealous pushed a little too far. Then Rishi got another open up. Mm. We got rolls on deck. Let's see how this one ends up. Oh, that was an instant. Reversal. Oh, Another was reversal? that a downer? Or I, it looked like it. it looked like a weak hit downer. It looked like he edge canceled it forward, which is rare. Where is she? That'll oh, wow. go. Okay. All right, 161 off the top. Yeah, tipper up there. That'll do it. It was a three and a half in a game. We got ultimate hype making noise somewhere yeah. out here. Yeah, ultimate. Ultimate got some some good players here for sure. A lot more people. But melee's kicking, man. Rishi Zealous. This is a this is a top level match, and we're just starting off the day. FD is an interesting choice. Um, you got to think that it's a little bit of a desperation move. Um, I know if I'm against the, really? the Fox, I, in my, from my experience in the Fox Ditto, it's probably different here. Um, I mean, the Fox Ditto, if you think they have a better chain grab than you, there's no reason to go That's here. That's just crazy. So but this I, one is all just like forward throw, pivot, tipper traps. And then when you don't get that, you just have to play neutral in like weird situations at high percents. Right. Like, like here. There, <laughs> there must be some reason why Zealous feels like he's in a better position to win on the stage. Like, it's it's a very specific stage, you know? It's not like, okay, I want small, so I'll go Yoshi's. It's like, I want no platforms. And I'm, I'm trying to really piece together why. Um, it's not going terribly. Uh, he wasn't really getting dominated on, like, platforms. Neither of them were really even using too much of them. They were staying on the bottom of Battlefield. Right. Maybe he feels like his punish game is a lot more refined, and he's going to take his odds. Maybe it's just the width of the stage. Something about it. Think so? I don't know. I have no idea. Yeah, right. I, we're 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 trying to figure it out. 
I don't know why Marth's like playing the ditto. I feel like they go to Fountain or something in a best of three. That's just pit Tipper City. Yeah. Couple nairs. This he could take the stock if he holds ledge. Oh wow, Rishi, perfect recovery. That he, he got it. You can't you can't not give him the benefit of the doubt there. You just got to hold ledge. Yeah, you got to do it really, really clean in textbook. It works. The fair could have sent him like somewhere off stage at that percent, but he got the phantom. Right. Zell's doing a really good job holding center there. Um, good movement. So going with the forward smash again, I, I guess, I don't know. I guess he didn't learn his lesson, or it worked out, but you got to It think just makes me wonder if he's going to do it again instead of going for ledge. Yeah. And then not the best recovery, to say the least. That's full stock. It's all about who gets the, the second fair in this matchup. Oh, yeah? Someone throws it out, and then someone comes in and gets it, or they get counterplayed. I just feel like Rishi, his experience with percentages is, is really coming oh, it's through. off the charts, dude. This you know, guy knows so much about this game. Like, going in with that fair, it was a cross-up fair with the, with the hilt. Um, I think that was on purpose. I think he knew at 0%, it's safe. And he just still has understood that, man, it's either.